The Shock Toolkit enables you to quickly get the information you need to make fast decisions when triaging patients in medical shock. Select the correct probe and preset in order to properly use the AutoVTI Auto Tool. In this case, the 3SC probe and the cardiac preset are used. Using B-Mode Imaging, demonstrate the left ventricular outflow track by performing either a three or a five chamber apical view. Here we are demonstrating a five chamber view. Select the Auto VTI tool if you are scanning live, located in the bottom left hand side of the touch screen. Your quality indicator will now be displayed. When green, the results are highly likely to match calculations created by an expert. When yellow, the results should be taken with caution. When red, no results are shown on the system. If you are scanning live, press freeze. You will then see your measurements displayed at the top left-hand side of your touch screen. In this case, I will select my measure icon and my measurement will appear. To calculate the cardiac output, the input the left ventricular outflow track diameter if known. You will simply input the measurement in the field shown. My LVOT diameter is two centimeters. I will demonstrate by inputting two, then tapping done. It will display alongside my LVOT VTI. If unknown, an LVOT diameter will need to be acquired. VTI trending is a tool that will allow you to quickly vis visualize and trend over the course of time and it will help determine the next course of action and treatment. To activate VTI trending, tap on your auto tools in the bottom left hand side of your touch screen and tap VTI trending. You will see this option while scanning live. Here is an example displayed. In order to use the auto IVC tool, select the correct probe and preset using B mode imaging to demonstrate the IVC in long axis as demonstrated here. Select the tab Auto Tool in the bottom left hand side of your touch screen, then tap Auto IVC. An automatic caliper will be placed in your proximal IVC. When green, the results are highly likely to match calculations created by an expert. When yellow, results should be taken with caution. When red, the results are not shown on the system. Auto IVC will automatically calculate the maximal and minimal respiratory cycle. Your IVC collapsibility will be displayed. For ventilated patient, tap on ventilated to acquire your distensibility index. To properly use the Auto Beeline Auto Tool, select the correct probe and preset. In this case, I will be using the C1 to 5 probe and the lung preset. The auto beeline tool highlights and counts the number of beelines in real time. Using B mode, demonstrate the desired lung space. Activate the auto tools tab on the bottom left hand side of your touch screen, then tap auto beelines. When live scanning, your quality indicator will appear. When green, the results are highly likely to match calculations created by an expert. When yellow, the results should be taken with caution. When red, no results are shown on the system. The system will automatically display the frame with the highest beeline count upon tapping freeze on a live exam. To use your lung diagram, tap on the lung icon in the left hand corner of the touch screen while scanning live. When you obtain the desired image of the lung with your auto beeline tool activated, tap on the segment in which the image corresponds. Tap on freeze, then store. A camera icon will appear in the lung segment you have acquired a lung image for. You can do this for each segment. To review the lung segments, tap review at the top of the touch screen. Here you will be able to review all the lung segment images with the beeline score in a single diagram. If you choose to store the lung diagram as an image, tap the store on the bottom right hand side of the touch screen. In order to use the eFast tool, select the correct probe and preset. In this case, the C1 to 5 and the eFast abdominal preset will be used. Tap store and that image will be stored and placed into the selected location of the diagram. 
At this time, you can select if free fluid was seen or not by tapping yes, no, or indeterminate. In this case, I will tap no. I will then select store on my touch screen. That image will now be stored. Continue your eFAST exam and store your images into the diagram. Upon completion of the eFAST exam, you can now review the eFAST diagram by selecting review on the top left hand side of the touch screen. Scroll through your images to locate your eFAST diagram. Select by double tapping to display in full screen.